I was an engineer and I had some experience in marketing and I was trying to expand into areas that I had no knowledge of. I think it would be inconceivable to start my own business without having attended Columbia Business School. When you're overseas, like sometimes the alumni themselves are, are like a smaller group. When you put them in the, like the whole of Columbia, you have people from the arts, from geology, from SIPA, from engineering, and the cross-pollinization that goes on when we meet, I think it really benefits the Columbia Business School network plus everybody else. I went back to, to school and what I in 2019, and what I saw was refreshing. The school really is keeping itself up to date. The quality of the faculty is fantastic. The quality of the students in class and the conversation is really superb. And I want all of that to continue. This is a school that has managed to keep itself on the leading edge of things for the longest time. When I was in school in 1997, Manhattanville was the future. I think the architecture brings the building, brings New York into the building, to the bridges on the walls, open spaces, which I think are aligned with an open mindset. I like to think that I'm giving back some of what Columbia gave me, and I want the institution to be as strong as it can be to the future and I invite you to participate in any way you can to help support this institution for the next generation of business leaders.